ओके सो वो रीज अपन वन दिस इज कैन हेयर वेलकम बैक टू टेक कर यूट्यूब चैनल दिस एंड देन वॉज इलेवन पॉइंट फाइव ऑफिशियल वर्जन विच इज जस्ट रिलीज सम टाइम गो वी हैव अ वीडियो ऑलरेडी अवेलेबल ऑन दैट आई एम जस्ट गो चेंज आई एम जस्ट गोन शेयर विद यू सम कूल इंटरेस्टिंग चेंजेस विच यू गेट हेयर विच आर सम कूल न्यू चेंज लॉग्स थिंग्स द डिफॉल्ट यू इज ऑलमोस्ट सेम लाइक द ऑल द प्रीवियस वर्जन द डिफॉल्ट वॉल पेपर सीम्स टू बी सेम हेयर दिस इज वट आई इंस्टॉल ऑन माई पोको एक्स थ्री एंड दिस इज नॉ अवेलेबल फॉर सम अदर डिवाइस इज ऑल्सो लाइक रेड बी नोट एट and you can install it from the official website by just going there the first thing if you are able to notice here is the bump effect after inst after using it after swiping down from this notification center you will see that effect whenever you open this quick settings panel on your device i don't think you will be able to notice in the video but this is the first change which you get here and looks quite good The second change which we have in our list is this volume panel. If you have noticed, the volume panel is now changed here like this one. This was not available in the previous builds, but now it's changed. It's actually at three steps. By the way, first was little bit tile kind of thing. Second, you need to expand, and third, you need to expand little bit more. Looks something different, something unique, and this is actually doesn't look that bad. So yes, if you have enabled the blur option, then this wall, this kind of volume panel looks damn cool and interesting. So yes, this is one. of the things which i liked about this build honestly speaking this is great in the settings options yes the ui is almost same these rounded i rounded kind of menus sub menus looks normal looks decent enough and let me just show you this kind of ui as you can see it has this cool new ui and settings app also and as you just saw this is the new volume panel which we have which is actually looking quite good by the way let me just show you once again that what are the options it includes for example we have the music we have the notification we have this volume panel alarm panel so some extra categories are also available here in other options let me just Let's talk about in the privacy section. We have Descendant Guardia. This is a very good feature that if you enable Descendant Guardia, it will show you that which app and how many times it requests for camera, microphone, GPS request. It's very helpful, by the way. And if you are concerned about your privacy, this is a very good thing. Install in third-party app. Listen for that app. and yes you'll be able to see that how many requests that app and how much things like camera microphone how many times the app is using on a device and when that's a very very important and useful feature and i like this feature a lot in this and i don't think so you get this feature in other custom rooms so descendant is just one of the great custom rooms focus on your privacy it's just good including this we also have some other features let me just show you it has this privacy features we have permission manager related options also in the in the security section it also comes with the app locker support for you here you also have this kind of options where it will show you if your device is rooted what is the security patch and what is the selenix status which is called integritas something is different by the way it's not that useful but yes it is still useful and something different of course it's just focus on privacy so yes looks good here in the lock screen extreme security option yes if you don't know whenever you have a secure locks you will not be able to use the quick settings panel expanded quick settings panel in the system option if you move on to the gestures if you move on to the system navigation if you have noticed now the feature is there which is called gesture bar length as c as you can see the space behind that google keyboard is now removed so yes a lot of users will definitely look into it one of the users including me i always look into it and yes it was there so i didn't need it to install any kind of third party module for that everything else is just kind of same here the performance seems to be good enough i'm using it for some time on my poco x3 the battery said battery stats honestly speaking are not that good the battery is approximately draining at 7% per hour or 6.9% per hour in my opinion after using just 55 without even using the 4g internet i don't think so it's just one of the greats we have many other customers better than that but yes we need to compromise some things to get some things and this is it is what is actually it is in the styles and wallpapers in the device wallpapers we also have some extra wallpapers present for you but everything else is just kind of same here these are some things you get here you can install some other more magic related things on a device if you want to customize this build of course you have the option to use the dual status bar status bar icon packs and a lot more things the safety status will definitely be passed doesn't matter if you're using any other custom or any other kind of device by the way This is all thanks for watching goodbye have a nice day
over the edge Feel like I'm floating through the air 